before we start, uh -huh. uh, I, I have got the clips, um, but it's about Charlie, but I can change it if you like. Well, so, what else you got? I've got two clips of Charlie, but it, I, I really like Go on, it. Then. We'll let you. Oh, we'll we'll, just we'll play the clips in just a second then. One of them is about Charlie being famous and how she's loving the paps. Okay. All right. And the other one, is, okay, I'll tell you later, but it's so funny. A bit like me then. She's in the diary room <laughs> and it's so funny. She's losing her mind. Oh, it happens. Yeah. It does. She's losing her mind. So let's talk about Big Brother last night. Unfortunately, I missed it last mm. night. Just, oh, oh, do you know what? I, I had a funny feeling that you were. <laughs> you yeah. might do that. You must have been really busy. What was you doing? I was busy doing other stuff. Other stuff. Okay. Other stuff, More yeah. important. Whining and dining, probably. Uh, no, 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 no. Okey cokey. Just, just doing but, stuff. Uh, but obviously you both caught it because you're addicted to Big Brother. Susie, what was the highlight of the show last night? This wasn't the highlight, but I've just got to mention this one. I can't believe it that Scarlett Johansson, I mean, she's lovely, asked Ziggy out on a date. Yeah, he, he, is is handsome. Handsome. he is handsome. I he's just can't believe he's that. Handsome. He's a creep. <laughs> I'm just looking at this. I mean, and obviously he boasted to all his mates. That's why it's in the paper. But can you believe it? Look at that. Now, that's Ooh. more his cup of tea when it comes to a woman, isn't it? Well, do you know She's what? Lovely. I think when he comes out, I might go to a few nightclubs and just go out to try and chat him up. Okay. We've got the Ziggy you. date. Ziggy date <laughs> sorted. Okay. Right. Let's okay. I think also, sorry. Um, when they were given a task for Big Brother's party, had five entertainers, oh, yes. <laughs> and then the others had to dress up and be like um, there was two clowns and other things. That's one of the clips I got. Charlie is a clown. Oh, oh really? Oh, 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 well, she went mental when they were this, oh. they, the ta as a clown to win the, the, the shopping bu budget list. Have you, have you, was she on the show last night dressed as a clown? No, no. no. Right. She was doing the practicing with Tracy. Tracy right. was the other clown. Well, the clip I've got, which we'll either do now or the next one. Uh, I think we'll do it the next one, uh, is when she's dressed as a clown and she does, she's not happy. Oh, <laughs> I mean, uh, well, she got told by Carol, you are a clown. Yes. yes. And Tracy, like, get over it, gravy, have it, have it, was telling her as well. Oh, they yeah. loved it, didn't they? Yeah, and she walked, marched out around oh. about 17 cigarettes and then came back in again. And basically, they, they was all okay with it. They know it's for a shopping task. And for some reason, she started going a bit ski whiffy in the head. She nobody wants, was talking to her. She mm. wanted to be the magician's assistant in the nice little fancy yeah, dress. Chanel. 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 Chanel's, Chanel's doing that. Chanel's doing that. But the thing is, she is a joke. So being a clown suited her perfectly. Yes, I think so. Yes. So we'll, we'll, I'd we'll, have been a clown as well. Yeah, I, I think it's a fun, fun character. I think you could have made that bit fun. Yeah. We'll play that clip of Charlie when she's dressed as a clown a little later on. Right. But this is a clip she was chatting to very various housemates about how famous she is and how much she loves it and everyone should move to London because that's where all the paps are. Have a listen to this. <laughs> yep. You come to London, you can't beat it, man. Oh, you get fussy up everywhere. Well, maybe you don't, but oh, it's fun. Yeah. Everyone's different. Yeah. You're a lot older well, than us, Tracy. More better than being in a play, I'll yeah. tell you. Well, this is all part of it. You're in Big Brother, so yeah. you've got to deal with it. London, a little bit up, is it? Oh, yeah. I'm not talking about just you. I'm talking about everybody. Because I won't be. Well, that's good thing. You'll go back to normal. Like, a little bit of money you're raising here. Which is good. That's what I want. I don't want anything else that's been in this. I'm not scared. Some of us do. Some of us are younger, so we can see it differently. Exactly. Yeah, you'll go old one day, mate. I understand. Yeah. It'll come to you. I'll take Maybe it'll in 15 time. years. But I'll have to say that. Maybe, maybe not. Maybe, maybe not. here because that's the sort of person you are. Exactly. It's what I like. So I won't say what? Not say so, but I'm just saying what I'm about. It's not about me being in London, being in the papers, because that's not who I am. Yeah. Well, you're going to be in it now, face it, on yeah, like a couple of months, and that's it. I won't exactly. Like it Some of us obviously will get more than others. We know yeah. that. We we'll probably realise that as we've been here. Because <laughs> you know, I sort of like it coming to London, because it's her sort of rave. She likes them sort of parts, don't you? It's them sort of parts we like. We're into R&B, hip hop, bit of house, and, bit of funky house, bit of all that. It's just fun. It's not where artists to be in the paparazzi. It's where they hang out. They hang out at the hangouts. They bring hangouts. I don't really know if I want to be in the paparazzi actually. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if I want to be in the paparazzi. Oh, do you don't think grief. she's there popping? Oh, yeah. <laughs> the paparazzi, James. I love the paparazzi, the way they go, ooh, but and they you try and put the thing under your skirt like that. Yeah. What are they doing, Jane? I try actually look and see if they're answering, I'm worried about the pictures. So they're trying to photograph you getting out of the car? Yeah, they're yeah. the funny long things, they try and go like that under your skirt, I've got your sweet off. It's going to be going under there, love. Really? Mm. Right, they've got a few of you in the stockings and stuff on there, they didn't know, they? that was only stocking suspenders getting out of the back of the car. Yes, unfortunately. Mmm, well. 
so, uh, that was. I flashed once as well coming out of Embassy in Mayfair. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hang on a minute, you what? I flashed the, the, no the cheeky, knockers. You, you flashed your knockers? Yeah. I know, I felt terrible. <laughs> not, all the mates ringing me up in the morning telling me I was worried. Look at Danielle's Don't horrified face. <laughs> Danielle, we go abroad and I <laughs> Oh, she's alright. It's only the bappers, isn't it? Yeah, it's only your bappers. Yeah, they're not that big, are they? Susie, are you going to flash, uh, flash your bappers? Well, <laughs> not walking down the high street now. No, I don't. No, no I, I ran and went, woo! You were, and then we chased you like that. We're trying also, to get the you had a lot to drink, Jane. Yeah. Mine, was un mine was really unfortunate. I'm in the back of the car trying to get out. And when they, the paparazzi at the very beginning, when they are absolute lunatics, you can't see, can you? It's just a, lo a wall of lights. Yes. I lost my shoe, couldn't get out That's why you feel like a Oh, it was oh. terrible. I lost my shoe, I got out. my foot caught around the seatbelt, my dress come back, and I mean, in the panic, thank goodness I did have knickers on, in the panic, there's all these photographs. I got out, my hair's all sort of dishevelled, and I was like, but they like all that. For goodness yeah. sake, leave me alone, can I not just get out? Then when I'd straightened myself up to smile, they went, no, we don't want pictures now. Yeah. And they're taking them. Do you know what, if we went to London, and say if I wore white shorts with the fishnet tights and white shoes classy that would probably <laughs> go in the paper right but if you just wear a little black number forget it yeah if you wear something that's horrid because i was in the heat mm. magazine with jordan and lisa presley couldn't believe it sorry right. i had to just get that bit in there Name dropper yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but I, my pink dress was one part 50 it was disgusting from the cherry shop <laughs> <laughs> and it was big as well good girl I was, well, like, I was like oh but you don't get a penny for it just put that on film yeah. really oh. <laughs> Just put it in well, the pats do. The pats why they're called the, the dirty diggers, aren't they? Or something the guys. Yeah. Next clip is Charlie. She's dressed up as uh, the clown and she looks a right mess. You wouldn't see that. Oh, I can't wait. Can't and wait. she's in the in the diary room having a right whinge at Big Brother. Oh god. Oh she's Same wrong with her. Misery guts. Big Brother it. updates every weekday morning, 7.35 and 8.35 right here.